So, yeah. so Steve pulls it all together at the last moment. We go live <laughs> like the curtain. We now launch and we just did it, right? We, yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Okay, so we're working. So if they're saying when marginal cost equals marginal benefit, what they're saying is the gap between the cost of procuring something and the benefit you get from that is maximized. It's a lot freer world back then than it is now. So I mean, I, 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 I feel for students these days and young people in general for what they experience. Would you talk, how would you describe what a contrarian is? Somebody who's, who isn't deluded by mainstream economics. Uh, Leon Volras in France, uh, Stanley Jevons in the UK, and uh, uh, Menga, I can't think of Menga's first name, Carl Menga. It's coming from a mathematician. Oh, he'd be so proud. <laughs> <laughs> You're decisive, man. I tell you, like, uh, I like the profanity drops every once in a while. <laughs> the way you introduce people is like, well, I really shouldn't. Oh, their name is this. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing nice little diagrams of intersecting lines saying, here's supply, here's demand, here's what they make. Uh, the two scissors of the blade, demand and supply together, set price and quantity, etc., etc. No, no, no necessity to be an asshole to be a good intellect. No, no. We, but you Sometimes know, it helps if you get those disturbances, but uh, yeah, it, it's but not you a necessity. Know that. I'm not like that, man. I'm reading your book. I'm looking at the footnotes. I'm like, the guy's funny. <laughs> I found myself in a weird situation. I never thought I'd be sitting in this sort of chair making those sorts of comments. I thought I'd be a foot soldier rather than a general, but I've ended up being a general, so I have to live with it. Well, I want to welcome everybody to the inaugural uh, podcast series uh, with Steve Keen.